Hey guys, Nylon here, and welcome back to some more Clash Royale. Today, we're going to be playing with the Freeze deck, as you guys can probably tell from the title and the thumbnail. But yeah, here's the deck, guys. We obviously use the Hog Rider. you got to use the Hog Rider when you're going with the Freeze deck. Got the Elixir Pump so we can cycle through this. It's a 3.8 average Elixir cost, which is pretty low. And of course, we got the Cannon to Distract. So the Cannon is just such a good card. I haven't really used it too much, but now that I've started to use it, it's such a low Elixir cost to distract the troops and also take them down it's really a must for most decks that use the free spell so yeah we're gonna go ahead and hop into some battles here but first i think i have a chest open here uh this is the clan chat right here uh you guys have absolutely just joined this clan so much i think we're full yeah at the moment uh we're, we're full 50 out of 50 members so uh it's gonna be hard to get in you just have to find when someone leaves you gotta join but yeah right now let's go ahead here yeah i do have one free chest open so we're gonna go ahead and crack that guy open right here uh maybe we'll get an epic who knows nope we definitely won't Oh, we did get zap spells and the uh, minions, which I mean, we're using in this attack right now, so it was a good opening. I do have to upgrade the hog rider, just haven't come up with the coins yet uh, to do that. We're almost there though, we're at uh, 1,200. This costs 2,000 upgrade. Anyways, guys, we're gonna hop into some battles. Let's do this. So before we get into a live battle here, I'm going to show you guys a quick replay. This is actually the first replay I've shown on my channel. So if you guys do like replays, let me know down in the comment section. If you don't, let me know as well. But yeah, I might speed this up a little bit uh, like this here. So yeah, he drops his Musketeers and the Bomber and a Valkyrie. I don't really do well against this push at all. As you can see, he's pushing in there, getting a few hits on the tower. And my minions go over there. Of course, he places the witch, and I get no hits. Uh, let's go ahead and speed up, or go down to normal speed now. Now, this is the push I really screw up on because my Valkyrie targets the giant and doesn't end up hitting any of the spear goblins or the witch. So they go in and they do a number to my little tower right there. Uh, the witch is just doing damage. We got the bomber going in to drop the minions as a last resort, and uh, finally we take those out. My tower's down to 241. Now the funny thing is, my tower doesn't end up going down, you guys will see here in a second. Uh, let's go ahead and speed up a little bit, place down another elixir pump so I can cycle through the deck, and here he comes with the musketeer. Uh, so what do I do here, I think I drop, yeah I drop a valkyrie and I actually get all of them this time, uh, luckily, and I drop a hog rider off to the left, I don't know why I did that, but I just wanted to see if I could do a number to that tower, but obviously he dropped his minions, okay let's go back to one or I guess normal speed, I guess you could say. So yeah, he's starting to slow push with the giant, and I'm sort of like, uh, this this game is, it might be over. And yeah, the giant's moving closer and closer. He got the bomber in the back. Now, this isn't really a hard push to take out. I just have to put the cannon down and get the minion horde going to take out the musketeer. But yeah, let's see what I do here. I forget what I do. I think I end up, oh, I end up freezing this. So yeah, you guys could use the freeze spell defensively and offensively. So it just took a freeze spell and a wizard and a Valkyrie, and all of that stuff is gone. Now I start a really strong push uh, with my hog rider, Valkyrie, and wizard. So they're going to go in there and do a little bit of damage to the tower. Do I freeze here? No, I don't freeze. I think... Oh, I actually did freeze. Weird. What did I? What am I thinking? Oh, I got two wizards down. Actually, that was a good idea because my wizards both stay alive, and we do a real number to the tower here, getting down to 607. He's placing a giant. I think he's just like, I need to take out this tower. I'm about to lose this battle here. Okay, so let's go ahead. We put down the cannon, and now we have five seconds left until double elixir, and overtime is of course. Okay, so I put my Valkyrie down. We go with the Hog Rider. I think this is the winning push right here that I get. I freeze everything. Hog Rider goes in. One. We zap everything. Two. And three. And we take the victory. So that was a really good replay where I use the freeze spell offensively and defensively. Here we go. Hopping into a live battle in Arena 7 with a level 8. I'm level 7, he's level 8, and he has over 2k trophies, so this is going to be a pretty interesting battle here, to say the least. Okay, let's drop the cannon. Come on, Pog, go over there. Okay, good. He moved over there. Let's put the Valk to take out those goblins, and there we go. Starting a nice little push here. I'm going to go ahead and place the Hog Rider, and we're going to be freezing in just a second here. Come on, Elixir Pump. Come on, Elixir Pump. Okay, I'm going to zap this. Let's zap. There we go. Oh no, he targeted the hog, so that was not a good push at all. That was actually a horrible push. All right, so we just got to start building up elixir here. We don't even need to worry about that mini P.E.K.K.A. coming in. I'm going to drop another elixir collector over here. Thank you for cannoning that one. I'll definitely take it. We got one starting up over there. All right, so we got the freeze spell yet again. We've got the wizard. Okay, he's going to push with this. Let's do that. And let's, of course, drop the minions here. I think he has a hog freeze deck, too. It really looks like he does. He hasn't shown me his freeze spell yet, but I can only assume that he's going to be freezing stuff in just a second here. Okay, he's got elix one elixir skeletons coming in. Not really going to do anything. That was a horrible use of those as well. Okay, so what should we do? 
Let's see here. We've got an elixir pump down. I think I'm going to start a slow push on the left here. He's got the cannon. He's got a pretty similar deck to me. Uh, I think he just uses the goblins instead of the minions that I use. Uh, all right, so let's see what we should do here. I'm going to put a wizard in the back, and we're starting a nice little push here. Okay, we need to freeze this. Okay, let's do that. We're freezing this over here. Let's put a cannon down, and uh, let's go. Uh, we're, we're pushing over on the left side. We got this going here. I'm going to put some minions down. Okay, mini pack is going to do work to that tower. I really just had to freeze that because I wasn't ready for that push at all. And he did a number to that tower. It's down to 1,000. Okay, hopefully we can do this. I need to get two elixir pumps down. Okay, so let's put this one in the middle here. Like that. Don't usually like using my elixir pumps as defense. I know some people do that. But why would you have an elixir pump as a defense? It just seems stupid. That's why I have the cannon. <laughs> that is why we're using the cannon here. Okay, so what should we do? Let's go ahead and start another push on the left side. I know he's going to be pushing on the right. Uh, so we have to be ready to defend that. Let's do this. And this, okay, he's putting the hog right. Let's do the cannon. I didn't have the cannon up last time. That was my crucial mistake. Okay, let's do that. Zap everything. Uh, get all that there. Nice. Okay, so we're defending against this well. We pulled the P.E.K.K.A. Now we've got a nice push going over this side. Let's drop another Valkyrie, and then we're going to drop the hog rider, and we're going to be taking this left tower here in just a second. I can only assume. Yeah, he's going to drop that. Let's go ahead and freeze this here. Okay, we didn't get the cannon, but we got pretty much everything else. Oh, gosh, Valkyrie's doing work. Let's put another wizard. Maybe we could three crown this guy. Uh, we, we might be overextending ourselves here. Yeah, we probably are. Okay, we got Got two wizards going in uh, should I do this I don't know if I should no we definitely shouldn't okay I'm gonna put another elixir pump down uh, we got two wizards doing work on the tower let's do this here uh, we, we, we've got uh, an Instagram notification ignore that guys we've got an Instagram notification okay there we go uh, let's go ahead and have the minions take out this. Oh gosh, the hogs can do it. Let's zap, zap, zap. Okay, there we go. We won. I don't know what I was thinking there. I was too focused on the Instagram notification, but we got the right. He got the right tower down to 95. I could have easily zapped there uh, since I had that up, but I just didn't. But anyways, let's get into another round. All right, here we go. Hopping into one more live battle. Of course, we're fighting up a level. I usually always fight up a level. I, I don't know what it is. I think it's because uh, I'm in the arena that are a lot of level eights. It's either level seven or level eight, and maybe we'll get some level nines as well. But uh, for the most part, mostly level eights. So yeah, he's pushing with spear goblins. I don't even think should we, let's just no We're not even gonna mess with those We want to be fighting on our side when the giant gets here. So let's do that We're also going to place a cannon right here to pull the giant and here we go Also, if you guys know how to turn notifications off for your entire phone Please let me know because uh, as you guys saw there we had notifications going off for Instagram And I thought I had do not disturb on but I guess I didn't let's zap this and uh, he's coming with the fireball But good thing the fireball doesn't actually take out my wizard at least uh, at this stage where people have like level I think six fireballs it really doesn't even kill my wizard which is good okay so we have a nice push going here uh, yeah okay nice we're, we're gonna be doing work to this tower let's go ahead and freeze this and uh, is he gonna place any troops or yeah I think he's really low on elixir we're actually doing a number without the hog too this guy's tower is gonna go straight down perfect I like the, the sound of that and we're gonna put elixir pump in the back right we're, we're actually Moving towards the King's Tower. Okay, the Valkyrie's just too strong, guys. I'm just putting that out there. Valkyrie's way too strong. Okay, let's go ahead and... Yeah, we'll just put the minions here. I should, probably should have put them earlier, but I was sort of deciding, should we let the minions go? Or uh, should, should we uh, counter them there? But yeah, we decided to counter them. I'm going to take a drink of water real quick. Why I'm drinking out of a candy cane glass, guys? Don't ask. <laughs> Don't ask. Uh, it's just a glass that I decided to pick out of the cabinet. Uh, so yeah, let's do that. Also going to put a Valkyrie down and a Wizard. Uh, and of course, we're probably going to zap all of these guys. Okay, there we go. Zap the Witch back there. The Witch doesn't have a lot of health, so the zap actually does a lot of damage. He's fireballing my Wizard again. Really doesn't do anything to me. Uh, what we're going to do in a second here, we can actually... Yeah, let's just put another Elixir Pump down. I'm going to play it safe. We've already got one of his towers. Maybe we could 3 crown this guy. I'm not really too sure if we can, though. All right, so what we're going to do, uh, let's push on the right side. We're going to do a hog freeze on the right side. Let's put a valve to distract these guys. I'm also going to put, okay, dang it. All right, let's do it. Come on, freeze. Oh, dang it, guys. We just missed it. Oh, did he, he, he freeze me over here. Okay, interesting. Uh, let's put a wizard down so we can take these guys out. And yeah, it looks like some of them got distracted by the cannon, which is good. Not really, dude, <laughs> he's just fireballing my tower. What is this guy thinking? Okay, let's put another elixir pump down. And I think we're going to start a push here. My wizard is going to go free roaming on that tower right there. Oh, gosh, he put a giant down. Okay, we're going to be able to counter this fairly easily. Here we go. Let's do that. I'm going to zap these guys here. And so we need to put a wizard behind. Oh, gosh. Okay, let's do this. we got to put the minions down. This is getting intense. Okay, he's actually pushing pretty hard right now. Uh, never mind. We took everything out. We're good. We're good. Uh, let's see. Got a nice push going. 
and uh, we won. We pretty much won. Uh, I just had to take his one tower out, and this guy was not able to really touch my towers at all. He just threw a few fireballs at the left tower. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy this freeze deck, be sure to hit that like button down below, and let me know what decks are you guys having trouble with. Maybe I could try and make one for the arena you're in to get out of it, and yeah, we'll see you guys tomorrow.